Now, the city of Moultrie is celebrating an Olympian of its own. Carson Tyler is a diver on Team USA and a Moultrie native. Well, the city is doing everything they can to show support for Carson. WAOB News 10's Mackenzie Blaze visited Moultrie and spoke to city officials there and business owners to see how they're honoring their hometown hero. The Olympics always bring out patriotism, but the city of Moultrie is all in on Carson Tyler. We have yard signs in a lot of the yards. The Cockle County Commissioners have put American flags around the Cockle County Courthouse, and we have the city come out and change out the banners to red, white, and blue just to show that we are supporting Carson. Local businesses also wanted in on the patriotic fund. The Art Center is one of them. We teamed up and contacted the Art Center and had them put together like a project so the artists can go and say, hey, we want, we heard that you were interested in having your window painted. Here are a couple of designs, check it out, tell us what you want to do, and then they go from there. After the Art Center finished painting a couple stores, more and more businesses began requesting Carson Tyler window art. Uh, we were really excited that our downtown director reached out um, in support of Carson and encouraged a lot of the vendors to come together and have their windows painted so we can show our hometown support of him. Now, the artists have almost 40 storefronts that still require painting. They hope to have all of them done by Carson's first event on August 6th. I mean, it's just so wild to see how much the businesses are supporting, you know, like this huge accomplishment that little old Moultrie is at the Olympics right now. On August 26th, the city will be holding a parade to honor Carson and his incredible achievements, as well as welcome him home. After the parade, city officials, including Mayor McIntosh, will be giving Carson the key to the city. Reporting in Moultrie, I'm Mackenzie Blaze with WALB, your hometown news source.